back to my brand new video. Today I'm going to be giving you my Match Week 21 Premier League predictions. If you enjoy this kind of content, make sure to slap a like as well as subscribe. And without any further ado, let's get right into this. You know I'm not a fan of long intros. So here we go. Liverpool against Chelsea. This game should be not very juicy because both teams have had bad seasons. And I don't think this is going to go quite well for either team. So I'm going to go out there and say nil nil. For Leicester City against Brighton, I see one clear winner. I think this is going to be a Brighton win. Even though they're selling Trossard, I think Brighton under Deserby have looked really good. Everything you take away from Brighton, they always just seem to do just fine. So I think that Brighton will do great and have a 3 nothing win at the King Power Stadium. Southampton against Aston Villa. I see Southampton are on good form. They've won their last three games, even though they're bottom of the league. In all competitions, they have won their last three games. So I think that this game will be good. But under Unai Emery, Aston Villa look really, really good. And I'm going to go ahead and say that this finishes in a 2-1 to -one Aston Villa win. 2-1 to the Villains. West Ham against Everton. I see stuff is not looking good at Everton, man. It's just not looking good, bro. It's really not. It's getting so toxic in there. They keep losing games. They've won the least league games this year. Only three wins. If you're an Everton fan, you really need to see more out of your team because you're just not doing good right now. And I don't see it getting better anytime soon. So I'm going to go, even though West Ham is also in the relegation zone, I'm going to have to say this, one day West Ham. For Bournemouth against Nottingham Forest, again, just like the Leicester and Brighton, there's one clear winner here. It's Nottingham Forest flying off the table, doing well in 13th place, five points clear in the relegation zone, I think. And even though that relegation pack is pretty congested, they are doing very, very good. And I think they will continue to do good, Nottingham Forest. And I'm going to say that they can pick up another win by the score of 3 to nil. Crystal Palace against Newcastle. Again, this one is kind of easy for me. I don't see any way Crystal Palace can win. They're not on the best of form, although they still are a decent team on their day. And I just don't see them playing very well here for this one. And I'm going to go ahead and say that Crystal Palace nailed Newcastle United too. I don't see any way out for Crystal Palace. For Manchester City against Wolves, Manchester City yesterday picking up a 4-2 comeback win from two goals down to win the game 4-2 against Tottenham, who we will mention later. So I just see this game being a Manchester City win again. Keeping up that title race, fighting hard fight into the end. If they win both their games against Arsenal, which is probably the hardest task you could possibly ask, I still see this being pretty good here. So I'm going to go Manchester City 3, Wolverhampton Wanderers 1, Leeds United against Brentford. I see Brentford ke keeping up their form here. I think it's going to be very good for Brentford here. I'm going to go ahead and say that Brentford can grab a 3-1 to one win. Tony Brace and Josh De Silva go and then for Leeds, they're going to lay Brendan Aronson goal, but it'll be too late then. For the game of the week, it's Arsenal against Manchester United. I think this game will be an absolute banger, a stud. It'll be amazing here. It's going to be an amazing game. Just, just you watch. This game will be absolutely fantastic, and it's going to be high scoring too. Four goals in it. Who will win, though? I'm going to say Arsenal 2, Manchester United 2 at the Emirates. It's going to be a great game. And our final matchup, we have Fulham against Tottenham Hotspur and London Derby. But who's going to win? It's going to be interesting to find out and see. I'm not quite sure who can pick up the W here. It's going to be a very exciting one, though. And who's going to win? It's going to be 2-1 to one Fulham. You heard it here first. Fulham are winning this game. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to slap a like as well as that subscribe button. Without any further ado, I'm going to sign off and I'll catch in a while. See ya.